We're hosting our championships today for 4A. In our first semifinal, Bernie Geneva, three sets to one. They'll be moving on the championship toward the winner of this game. We have Grace Prep Academy. They're out of Arlington. They're in Navy. And in red, Trinity Christian Academy, Trinity Christian School out of Lubbock. Both teams are getting ready. They're finishing their hits. Thank you for joining us on TAPS Radio and TAPS TV for today's contest. Again, thank you for joining us on TAPS Radio and TAPS TV for Volleyball 2019, the 4A semifinals. Arlington Grace Prep, Lubbock Trinity. The Lions and the Lions will be coming up shortly here from University High School, Waco, Texas. Thank you for joining us again for today's semifinal contest. Hi, we're thrilled to be here today with our new partner, Chipotle. Um, and I'm here with Shane, and Shane is representing them here in Texas. And we're thrilled with this new partnership. Tell us a little bit about why Chipotle chose to be a partner with TAPS. Yeah, so Chipotle understands the importance of nutrition. And so Chipotle has essentially started a whole new initiative of Real Food for Real Athletes. And Chipotle understands that um, athletes need to eat a little differently than the regular Joe and so they are bringing proper nutrition and a little bit of education to the sports world. And then tell us a little bit about what you're doing with the schools um, once you've met with the coaches here in the hospitality lounge at volleyball. Um, tell us what your goal is um, in interacting with our coaches and our families. Yeah, so we're working to get into the schools to provide athletes education on um, the proper ways to eat. So we will talk to coaches, um, first get them to understand that um, what we're doing is going to be beneficial for their program, for them, and for their athletes. And so we will then go in, uh, we'll talk to their athletes, we'll give nutrition talks, team talks, um, however that may be, um, and we'll talk to the athletes about macronutrients and the fuel that they put in their body. Now, I understand that you guys are actually giving out trophies as well. Are you a good luck charm? Are you influencing who wins? 
I don't know if I'm gonna influence who wins, but I will sure be a great little token once they do win. Absolutely, and perhaps if they've had um, real food for real athletes, they will win. Thank you, Shane.
over it's time to play volleyball here in waco texas thank you again for joining us on taps tv and taps radio our thanks to tasso our tasso officials are up to the task it was an excellent we call first game and we look forward to nothing short here in the second thank you for joining us on taps tv and taps radio for volleyball 2019 Taps would like to thank the Waco Convention and Visitors Bureau, along with the Waco Sports Commission, for their continued partnership with Taps to make Waco, Texas, the championship city for Taps. Children's Health wants to keep your athletes safe and playing strong. Children's Health, Andrews Institute for Orthopedics and Sports Medicine, brings our trainers here today. Hopefully they won't be needed, but if they are, our student athletes are in good hands with Children's Health, Andrews Institute. Taps would also like to thank Wilson Sporting's Good, the official ball of Taps. Taps is proud to continue our sponsorship with Wilson Sporting Goods. Also today, our new partner, Chipotle. Chipotle, real food for real athletes. Thank you for joining us here today for Taps TV, Taps Radio's production of Volleyball 2019, the 4A semifinals. Cheerleaders are ready, coaches are ready, teams are ready. The officials are making their last counts. They're looking, they're looking at all four corners. They checked the net. Cheerleaders look ready to cheer. We're ready for our first serve of the game. Let's go, 
Both schools have brought a good crowd today. We're looking forward to a great environment for high school volleyball. First up with a serve, Madeline Ritchie, Lubbock Trinity. They'll begin the game. Madeline Ritchie, send us into the game. Number 13 was set. That was Taylor Morgan, unable to clear the net. Lubbock Trinity one, Grace Prep zero. Richie again with the serve. Ball recovered, good tip at the net. Another point for Lubbock. Lubbock Trinity two, Grace Prep zero. Richie again with serve. Ball recovered well by both teams. Ball fouls short. Number one, Courtney Creighton went up for the block. Unable to get it back across the net. Love it, Trinity three. Arlington Grace Prep zero. Here at Taps Volleyball 2019. Next serve will bring us to Grace Prep one, serving Love it, Trinity three. Number one, Courtney Creighton. Served deep on the near side, recovered by number three. Ball sent over by number zero, Kinsey Burleson. Nice tip there, flying in from the outside by Grace Prep. Few people in the way, but it was number six, Hannah Reeves. Point to Lubbock Trinity, 4-1. This is number zero, Kinsey Burleson. Number 15, Sage Post was able to send it over. Good hit from the far side. From my vantage point, it was Brooke Cox with the hit. Number zero, Kinsey Burleson serving 5-1. Good serve received. We're gonna set near side to number six. That was a hit by Hannah Reeves. Officials whistle at the net, point Grace Prep. Grace Prep two, Lubbock Trinity five. That's gonna be number 15, Sage Post stepping to the back. Senior outside hitter for Arlington Grace Prep. We're gonna go far side to number nine. They were trying to set Brooke Cox and they did. We'll go to Cox again. Good block at the net. Good receive that time by number two. That's number three for Grace Prep with a touch, Bonnie Davis. Number nine sends the ball across. Good recovery by Davis. Ball drops. Point for Grace Prep. Grace Prep brings us back. Grace Prep three. Lubbock Trinity five. Still serving. Number 15, Sage Post. Coach Lewis and Post have got their signal straight. See where she goes. She goes straight down the middle. Ball set to number far side to number nine, Brooke Cox. Brooke Cox with the kill. Brings our score, Lubbock Trinity six, Grace Prep three. Stepping back to the service line is number four, Callie Johnson. Callie Johnson, a senior setter. Sends the ball deep to the middle. Ball misplayed. Madison McDonald couldn't quite get her hands on it. Score, Lubbock 27, Grace Prep 3. We still have number four, Callie Johnston with the serve. Callie's the senior setter. Coach Neal with the signals. She goes short to the middle. Good recovery that time by number two, Madison McDonald. Good block at the net. That was number three. Peyton Dove and number 12, Madeline Cox. Good job that time on the block. Love it, Trinity eight, Grace Prep three. Callie Johnston with the serve. Deep to the near side, ball played by number one far side. That was number six with a hit. That was Hannah Reeves. We've got number nine, that's Brooke Cox. Block at the net. Point, Grace Prep, Grace Prep. 
Brings our score to 8-4. Ball played to the far side on the whistle point. Grace Prep. I think that brings our score to 8-5. We got a little discrepancy here on the scoreboard here. Our scoreboard shows Lubbock Trinity 9, Grace Prep 4. Ball served deep, returned by Kenzie Burleson. That was number three for Lubbock making the hit. Good block at the net. On the official's whistle, point, Lubbock Trinity, Lubbock Trinity 10, Grace Prep 4. We've got number nine stepping to the back. That's going to be Brooke Cox. Brooke Cox, our senior outside hitter. She's been featured here this morning. Sends the ball in. Officials flag was quick and decisive. Lubbock Trinity 11, Grace Prep 4. Brooke Cox, senior outside hitter again with the serve. Coach Neal emphatic on this direction. She sends the ball deep to this near corner. Ball is set this way. It's number three with the hit. That was Bonnie Davis. We're going to set number 12. That's number 12. Madeline Cox with a hit from the middle for, on the point for the Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity Lions 11, Grace Prep Lions 5. Game 1 for a volleyball semifinal number 2. Timeout, Grace Prep. Timeout will take us to a one-minute timeout. Grace Prep trails Lubbock Trinity 5-11 to 11 here in Game 1. Thank you for joining us on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio. Cheerleaders have come and they've performed for us here. It's good to have cheerleaders from both squads. The fans are pretty packed for Lubbock and Grace Prep. Lubbock Trinity 11, Grace Prep 5 as we get ready to return to action. See what Prentice Lewis words of wish and bring for Grace Prep. We're looking forward to an exciting first game. We have number nine. That's outside hitter, senior Brooke Cox with the serve. Ball clipped the net and fell short. Grace Prep able to recover. That's number 12, Cox again. We're coming near side, number three. That was Bonnie Davis. Outside to number three for Lovett. She goes all the way across, hit by number five, Madeline Ritchie. Number three, Davis plays through the block. Point, Grace Prep. It's going to bring our score. Grace Prep six, Lovett Trinity 11. Serving for Grace Prep. Looks like number six, Hannah Reeves. And it is. She brings the ball to number zero, Kinley, Kinsey Burleson. Hit that time from the far side. Good dig by number 15, Sage Post. Ball sent wide. It's going to be score point for the Lubbock Trinity Lions. Lubbock Trinity 12, Arlington Grace Prep 6. Stepping back to serve is going to be number 12. That's Madeline Cox. Number 12, Madeline Cox, middle and blocker. Good serve received. We're setting number 15. She flat foot sends it deep. Ball the far side to number five, Madeline Ritchie. Sent near side to number three, Bonnie Davis. Blocks, sends the ball to the floor for a Lubbock Trinity point. Lubbock Trinity 13. Arlington Grace Prep six. Again, number 12, Madeline Cox. They looked to come to number 14, went backside. Backside to number three was Bonnie Davis, unable to connect. 14 for Lubbock Trinity, six for Grace Prep. Madeline Cox with the serve. 14, Ball played off of number 14, Lacey Young for a Lubbock Trinity point. 
Well, up at training 15, Grace Prep 6 here in game number one of this semifinal match to see who will play Bernie Geneva in the championship. Cox serves middle short. This is number three, Davis. Davis fights through the block for a point. Score, Grace Prep 7, Lubbock Trinity 15. Number three, Bonnie Davis with the serve. Ball goes wide to number five. Number five, Madeline Ritchie was looking deep just outside. Flag goes up. Grace Prep 8, Lubbock Trinity 15. It's going to be number three, Bonnie Davis. Net serve, point Trinity, Trinity 16, Grace Prep 8. That brings us back to number three, Peyton Dove. Peyton Dove with her serve today. Near side to number 15 with the touch. That was Sage Post. Ball goes to number 14. 14. And Nissa Marino thought she had the tip. That's number four for Lubbock getting in the action. Four sets, 14 again. Marino up to the task. Good blocks at the net. See you with a point. Point. Grace Prep. Grace Prep, nine. Trinity, 16. Number two. Number 14 for Grace Prep. We're going to have Lacey Young at the service line. Number 14, Lacey Young, freshman middle. Burleson, good with the receive. That's number five with the touch. Number five, Madeline Ritchie, Point Lovett. Trinity 17, Grace Prep 9. 17 to 9, Lovett Trinity over Arlington Grace Prep. Here in game number one of volleyball, semifinal number two, volleyball 2019. That's number five, sending the ball into play, Madeline Ritchie. Number one sets us near side to post. Post with the kill. Excellent job by Courtney Crady and setting her teammate Sage Post. Grace Prep 10, Lubbock Trinity 17. Serving number one, Courtney Creighton. She's a junior setter. Lubbock Trinity able to dig out of trouble. Ball finds the ground. That was number 14, Marino with the touch. Lubbock Trinity 18, Arlington Grace Prep 10. 10. Grace Prep is clawed back to within three or four, and each time a run has come. We have Lubbock Trinity 18, Burleson with the serve. Grace Prep 10. Good recovery that time by number 13, Taylor Morgan for Grace Prep. Number nine with the hit on the far side. She's returned to the front. That's Brooke Cox. Excellent hit that time by Grace Prep. Earns the point. Grace Prep 11. Lubbock Trinity 18. There's Sage Post number 15. Return for serve. Sage Post, senior outside hitter. Net serve gives the point to the Lions of Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity 19, Arlington Grace Prep 11. Number four, that's going to be Kelly Johnson, our senior setter for Lubbock. Set for the tip on the far side. Good block, good work at the net by both squads. Excellent hustle by Lubbock Trinity, unable to come up with a point. Good pushover by the Grace Prep Lions. Grace Prep 12, Lubbock Trinity 19. Our libero number two, Madison McDonald. Sophomore with the serve. Went deep middle, Burleson able to recover. Comes off, see if they can get it, they did. The stealing has come into play a couple of times today. That was Courtney Trayton trying to get the push over, unable to secure the point. Lubbock Trinity with the point, moves to 20. Lubbock Trinity 20, Arlington Grace Prep 12. Number nine, Brooke Cox.
This time we'll go number five. They were looking for Madeline Ritchie. Ball stays into play. Good job by Grace Prep. That's number 12 for the Tigers, unable to clear the block. Sorry. What a Trinity. Madeline Cox unable to fight through the block at the front. In the front, you had 14. Lacey Young in three. Bonnie Davis. Our servers from Grace Prep down 13 to 20 here in game number one. That was number six, Hannah Reeves. Try to tip over the block successful. We're setting here to the near side to number three, Bonnie Davis. Good shot by Davis. Score for Grace Prep. Grace Prep 14, Lubbock Trinity 20. Again, number six, Hannah Reeves will serve. And as a junior, junior middle. Deep to the middle. She scores the ace. 15 for Grace Prep, 20 for Lubbock Trinity. Number six, Hannah Reeves is on a roll. We have a timeout by Coach Neal. Timeout, Lubbock Trinity. Our score, Lubbock Trinity 20, Arlington Grace Prep 15. 4A semifinal number two brought to you from Waco University High. Thank you for joining us on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio. Coming out of the timeout, it's the Battle of Lions, Arlington Grace Prep and Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity leading 20 to 15. Service remains with Grace Prep. Number six, Hannah Rees with the serve when we return to action here at Waco University High. Thank you for Waco ISD for hosting this year's championships. And thank you for joining us on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio. Good serve, tough handle. Point, Grace Prep. Grace Prep 16, Lubbock Trinity 20. Good service to turn that time. That's number three for Lubbock Trinity. Peyton Dove puts it into the Grace Prep run. Lubbock Trinity, 21. Arlington Grace Prep, 16. Number 12 for the Lubbock Trinity, Madeline Cox. She'll sub out. Number 13 subs in. Number 13 is Lily Underwood. Lily Underwood, a junior setter. Straight and deep. Good return that time by Grace Prep. We set Bonnie Davis. Ball falls out, sailed a little wide off Cali Johnston. Point, Grace Prep, Grace Prep 17, Lubbock Trinity 21. It's going to be number three, Bonnie Davis with the serve. Bonnie Davis serving with the lead, 21-17. Burleson re-enters the contest for Lubbock Trinity. Coach Lewis with last second instructions. Good return that time. Good job of digging out by number nine. That was Brooke Cox. Ball sent in. Ball played back overhead by Courtney Creighton. I thought she caught him napping, but she didn't. Good job by the Trinity. Good job by Grace Prep continuing forward. That was number 15, Sage Post. She went close to an net and cross court. She earns the point for Grace Prep. Grace Prep 18, Love of Trinity 21. Number three, Sage Post. Sage Post, senior outside hitter with the serve. Deep to the near corner. We're going to set number five. That was Madeline Ritchie. Burleson to Johnston. Johnston back to number three. Peyton Dove, good save that time by Grace Prep. But the ball sails high and wide. Flag up quickly for out of bounds. It's 22 for Love of Trinity, 18 for Grace Prep. Our serve will be number three, Peyton Dove.
Both coaches with instructions. Good job that time of Bonnie Davis with the receive. This is number 15, Sage Post with the hit. Handled by Lubbock Trinity, Lubbock Trinity number five. Madeline Ritchie with the hit to earn the point. Lubbock Trinity 23, Grace Prep 18. Lions on Lions, 23 for Lubbock Trinity and number three, Peyton Dove. Timeout, Grace Prep. Grace Prep down, 18-23, Lions to Lions. Waco University High, semifinal number two of the 4A championships. Thank you for joining us on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio. Aiden loves playing baseball. He's in his element when he picks up a baseball bat. When Aiden tore his ACL last year, we were all devastated. We didn't think that a 13-year-old could have a problem such as that. Children's Health Andrews Institute for Orthopedic and Sports Medicine not only repaired Aiden's ACL, but they gave him the knowledge and skills to prevent any future injuries. Now, less than a year later, he's back to hitting homers and doing phenomenal. Here in the timeout, Grace Prep cheerleaders clear the court. The Lions return. Lubbock Trinity in red. Grace Prep in navy. Both set and ready. Number three, Peyton Dove with the serve for Lubbock Trinity. <laughs> Number 15, Sage Post. I don't know if that's what Coach Lewis drew up, but she executed it well. That ball attacked not only the court, but us over here at the broadcast area. We've got a substitution with number 12. Number 12, Lydia Carreri entering the contest. She will be serving. Carreri is a sophomore defensive specialist. She puts the ball into play. Love it, Trinity, mishandle. It's 23 for Lubbock Trinity, 20 for Grace Prep. Carreri's done her job. She earned the point. She goes back to serve again. Ball played off of number nine. Burleson now plays, goes to number five, Richie. Good job that time of Bonnie Davis keeping it play. Number five, 15, Sage Post almost had the tip. Ball played over by 14, Marino. Ball kept in play to number five, Richie. Ball doesn't clear the net or the block. Grace Prep, 21. Lubbock Trinity, 23. Timeout this time by Coach Neal of Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity, 23. Arlington Grace Prep, 21. As we go to break here on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio. Finish first, Grace Prep second, both teams. Lubbock Trinity in red, waiting for service received. Grace Prep and Navy. It's gonna be number 12, Lydia Carreri with the serve. She won her first point and her second. <laughs> Officials are back. Officials are ready. On the whistle. Quick reminder to not use flash photography. We're back under play. Carreri with the serve. Looks like they're going to go far side to Richie. Richie off the block. That's number one, Creighton, setting up post. Excellent recovery by Grace Prep and Lubbock Trinity. Mishandled by Trinity. Giving away that point. Cuts the lead to one. Grace Prep 22, Trinity 23. Quick conference by the officials. See if that point stands. Yeah. 
It does, in fact, bring our score 22-23. Carreri, the serving specialist, has come in to bring Grace Brett back to life. They only trail by one. This one she sends long. That'll give the serve to Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity 24, Grace Brett 22. It is game set point. Number five, Madeline Ritchie. We'll see if she can close it out with this serve. Substitutions made by Grace Prep. Ritchie puts it in play. Ball received and sent back over. Burleson sends it wide. That's number nine. Number nine hit sails wide. Brooke Cox narrowly missing the wide shot. Number 11, Lauren Catherman inning job contest for Lubbock. Number five, that's going to be Madeline Ritchie taking a seat. It's 23-24. Grace Prep trails by one. And number one, Courtney Creighton with the serve. Played back over to the far side. They went nine, Cox. 15, Sage Post. It's through the block. They're setting number nine again. Brooke Cox. Excellent save that time by number two, Madison McDonald. See what her teammates can do this time. McDonald sends the ball over. Love it, Trinity resets. There's Cox. This time, Cox's shot falls inside the back line. Quick flag down. It's Love it, Trinity winning game number one, 25-23. Thank you for joining us for semifinal number two of the TAPS 4A State Championship here on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio. game 25 23 grace prep fought back valiantly from an early deficit but couldn't quite get over the hump coach lewis and coach neal giving last minute instructions will be lubbock trinity and grace prep returning to action shortly here on taps tv and taps radio One minute left in our set break. We'll be back momentarily with the action here from University High in Waco, Texas. Thank you for joining us on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio for 4A semifinal number two to see who will advance to tomorrow's final with Geneva School of Bernie. Lubbock Trinity on the left side of your screen. I'm sorry, on the right hand side of your screen in red. It'll do the Grace Prep Lions in Navy on the left side of your screen. Service to come here in game number two.
Thank you for joining us here. Number one, Courtney Creighton. Sends the game number one into action. That's Lubbock Trinity number nine. That's going to be Brooke Cox with a hit. That's number 15, Sage Post, earning the first point. Sage Post puts Grace Prep up one nothing here in game number two. Courtney Creighton. Harlison sends the ball back across the net. It's a jumble in the front. Pushed over by number four, number one. Creighton sets number six. Ball falls just out of bounds. That was Hannah Reeves that tried to touch. Unable to keep it in. Number zero, Kenzie Burleson. Set post, post fights through the block. This is number three coming from the back row. That's Bonnie Davis. Bonnie Davis brings Grace Prep two, Trinity one. This is Sage Post, number 15. Her serve sails long, ties us up at two. Number four, number four, Callie Johnston steps back to serve. Callie is our senior setter for Lubbock Trinity. She sends the ball short. That's number three, Bonnie Davis with the kill. Bonnie Davis, number three, junior outside here for Grace Prep. Puts Grace Prep ahead, three to two. Number two, libero, Madison McDonald. Madison McDonald for Grace Prep. Left-handed, sends the ball short. Good hustle, had a little spin, unable to control by Lubbock Trinity. Grace Prep four, Lubbock Trinity two. Again, number two, Madison McDonald serving. Ball handled well this time. Number four setting number three. Number three was Peyton Dove. Grace Prep unable to control. Point, Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity three serving Grace Prep four. It's going to be number nine, Brooke Cox with the serve. Quick set to number six, found the block. See what Grace Prep can do. Grace Prep's able to get up. The block goes wide. Point, Grace Prep. Grace Prep five, Love of Trinity three. This time we'll have number six serving for Grace Prep. That's going to be Hannah Reeves. Hannah Reeves with the serve. Burleson with the receive. She sets number five. Big hit by Madeline Ritchie, unable to clear. Ritchie will try again, tries to go across, finds the block. That's going to be a point for Grace Prep. Grace Prep six, Lubbock Trinity three. Again, it's going to be number six, Hannah Ritchie with the serve. That time the set went to number 12, Madeline Cox. Madeline Cox earns the point. Lubbock Trinity four, Arlington Grace Prep six. Number 12, Madeline Cox, after earning that point, will step back to the serve. Net serve. Point earned by Grace Prep. Grace Prep seven, Trinity four. Grace Prep won the first set. Good job that time by number three, Bonnie Davis. On the far side, that was number three, Peyton Dove with the kill. Peyton Dove earning the point for Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity five, Grace Prep seven.
Number three, Peyton Dove with the serve. Peyton's a senior. Sends the ball deep to the near corner. Ball set to the far side to number 15 post. Lubbock Trinity's able to keep the ball in play off the block. Sends the ball back over. Grace Prep on the offensive. Sage post again. Ball comes wide this side to number five. Number five, Madeline Ritchie unable to keep it in. Point, Grace Prep. Grace Prep eight, Trinity five. Lions on Lions, Grace Prep in Navy. Lubbock Trinity in the red. They look ready, both sides await. Serve that time by number 14 and she earns the point, Lacey Young. Lacey Young brings our score to Grace Prep nine, Trinity five. Return that time by number nine, Cox. Hit by five, Richie. Ball goes to the far side, able to push it over. It was 15 Sage Post. Now we have a hit coming from number five. That was number five, Madeline Richie. She brings our score. Lubbock Trinity six, Arlington Grace Prep nine. Number five, Madeline Richie. We're setting Sage Post on the far side. And the block by four and 14. That was the block by Callie Johnston and Anissa Marino on the point for the Lions of Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity seven, Arlington Grace Prep nine. Richie again with the serve. Setting post, post with the dump. Number four for Lubbock Trinity. Callie Johnston wasn't fooled. She sends the ball over for a point and brings us to within one. Lubbock Trinity eight, Arlington Grace Prep nine. Richie with the serve. Sage Post off the block. Lubbock Trinity able to control. They go to number nine. Nine's hit comes back, close at the net. Good net play by both teams. We're setting number 14, Marino. Block and then sent back over by Marino. Quick dump by number one. That's Courtney Creighton earning the point for Grace Prep, and Courtney Creighton will step back to serve. 10-8. We've made our service rotation. Courtney makes her second serve in this set. Arlington Grace Prep, 10. Lubbock Trinity, 8. It's Courtney Creighton with the serve. We're coming this near side to number nine, Cox. Creighton goes to 15. She sent it over to Sage Post. Sage Post sends the ball long, but they say there was a touch at the net. There is a touch at the net. Point goes Grace Prep's way. Grace Prep 11, Trinity 8. That's number one, Courtney Creighton continuing with serve. Officials confer. We'll see what the outcome is. They say there was a touch. Point stands. Grace Prep 11, Trinity 8. Set number two. Grace Prep coming from an 0-1 hole. They lost the first set in a 25-23 nail biter. Courtney Creighton sends us into action. Good job that time. Good job that time by another 11, Lauren Catherman to get the ball back up, but unable to clear the net play. Grace Prep wins the point. Grace Prep 12, Lubbock Trinity 8. Courtney Creighton with serve. Burleson gets to the ball, but can't keep it in play. Point, Grace Prep. Grace Prep 13, Lubbock Trinity 8. Looks like we have a timeout by the Lions of Lubbock Trinity. Grace Prep 13, Lubbock Trinity 8. Here from Waco University High. Thank you for joining us on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio for today's semifinal action. Aiden loves playing baseball. He's in his element when he picks up a baseball bat. When Aiden tore his ACL last year, we were all devastated. We didn't think that a 13-year-old could have a problem such as that. Children's Health Andrews Institute for Orthopedic and Sports Medicine not only repaired Aiden's ACL, but they gave him the knowledge and skills to prevent any future injuries. 
Now, less than a year later, he's back to hitting homers and doing phenomenal. Courtney Creighton brings us back into the action with serve. Both teams are ready. Looks like the officials are ready. Grace Prep 13, Trinity 8. We're back underway here at Waco, Texas. That time Marino came attacking from far and deep. She earns the point for the Lions of Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity 9, Arlington Grace Prep 13. Number zero is going to be Kinsey Burleson stepping back to serve. Official flag goes up immediately. It's out and it's long. Grace Prep 14, Lubbock Trinity 9. Number 15, Sage Post. Sage Post with the serve. Catherman able to recover. They go back to number nine. That was a hard shot by Brooke Cox, but save. Ball goes long, unable to control. Catherman made a diving effort, but unable to control it. Grace Rep 15, Lubbock Trinity 9. Number 15, Sage Post to serve. Set for number 12, comes in hard. Madeline Cox drops it off. This is number six. That was number six. Hannah Reeves shot blocked at the net. Point, Lubbock Trinity, Trinity 10, Grace Rep 15. Number four, Callie Johnston with the serve. Lubbock Trinity sent that ball just a little too long on the serve receive, and Lubbock Trinity jumped all over it. Lubbock Trinity 11, Arlington Grace Prep 15. Johnson again with serve. See where they go. They went short to number six. They were looking for Hannah Reeves. Now we have number nine for Lubbock Trinity coming with the attack. That was Brooke Cox. Good play at the net to slow that one down. We come back to Brooke Cox again. Good job by Grace Prep to get down. That was Libero, Madison McDonald, but she was unable to keep the ball in the quarter play. Grace Prep 15, Lubbock Trinity 12. Number four, Callie Johnston with the serve when we return from a Grace Prep timeout. Timeout, Grace Prep here in semifinal number two. Taps Volleyball 2019, Lubbock Trinity 12, Arlington Grace Prep 15. Thank you for joining us on Taps Radio and Taps TV. Officials whistle brings both teams back onto the court of play. Grace Prep in Navy from our left. Lubbock Trinity in red from our right. Number four. That's going to be setter senior Callie Johnston. It's time we go to the far side looking for Davis. We go to Davis again. Davis able to get the ball over. Love it, Trinity, unable to control. Ball sails out of bounds. That's going to be point Grace Prep. Grace Prep 16, Love it, Trinity 12. Uh, Libero, number two, Madison McDonald. She'll have our serve. 
It's that left-handed serve, grabs the net and drops to the floor. Point Grace Prep, 17 to 12. Grace Prep over Trinity. Madison McDonald, left-handed. This time the ball catches too much of the net, and it's going to be a net serve, bringing her score. Trinity 13, Grace Prep 17. To serve for Lubbock, number nine, Brooke Cox, senior outside hitter. It's time we set number six, and she's able to dump across the deal. Hannah Reeves, Hannah Reeves comes straight across the net, right past the block. 18 for Grace Prep, 13 for Trinity. Number six, number six is Hannah Reeves. Hannah Reeves, net serve, point, Lubbock Trinity. Trinity 14, Grace Prep 18 here in game number two. Looks like number 13's re-entering the game. Number 13 is Lily Underwood. She served well in the first game. See what she can do here. Number 13, Lily Underwood. Ball put up for number three. That was going to be Bonnie Davis on the whistle. Point awarded Lubbock. Lubbock Trinity 14. Arlington Grace Prep 18. Sorry, Lubbock Trinity 15. Grace Prep 18. Underwood again. It's number three, Davis. Time we're setting number five, Madeline Ritchie. Madeline Ritchie from the front left corner, attacks cross court. Lubbock Trinity 16, Arlington Grace Prep 18 here in game number two. Number 13, Underwood continues her serve. Deep into the middle. We're setting number three, Davis. Davis comes with that powerful right hand. Point, Grace Prep, Grace Prep 19, Love at Trinity 16. Back to serve number three, Bonnie Davis. Davis scans the court on the official's whistle. She's ready for play. Burleson keeps it in. This time we set number 14. That's going to be Marino. See where we go this time. We go to number three. I'm sorry, that was number five. Sorry, Madeline Ritchie, I miscalled it. Madeline Ritchie with the kill. Lubbock Trinity 17, Arlington Grace Prep 19. Number three, that's Peyton Dove. She'll have serve. Senior Peyton Dove, number three for Lubbock Trinity. Good job by McDonald to set it. They're looking for Paige, Sage Post. This time they go back to three, Davis. Davis catches just enough of the net, falls in for point, Grace Prep. Grace Prep 20, Trinity 17. Number 14 for Grace Prep is Lacey Young. Lacey Young with our serve. She makes the handoff on the sideline. She hands the ball off to Lily, Lydia Carreri. Carreri served excellently in the first game. See where she comes from now. Goes deep to the near corner. It's time we set the ball up to number five, Richie. Looks like we got unable to complete the point. Excellent job by Richie. Richie steps back to serve. Madeline Richie down 18 to 20. Grace prep in the lead. Richie looks to serve. Good push over that time by number one, Creighton. See where Creighton chooses to set. She sets three, Davis. Davis unable to clear the net. We have a one point game. Trinity Christian 19, Grace Prep Academy 20. That time Richie sends it into the net, net serve. It's a two point lead for Grace Prep. Grace Prep 21, Lubbock Trinity 19. 
Stepping back to serve is our setter, number one, Courtney Creighton. Ball played to number nine. Number nine is Brooke Cox. Brooke Cox with the kill. Back to a one-point game. Number zero, that's going to be Kinsey Burleson serving. Lubbock Trinity trailing 21-20. Clipped the net, went low, point Lubbock Trinity. We're all tied up at 21 apiece. Lubbock Trinity Christian 21, Arlington Grace Prep 21. And number zero, Kenzie Burleson will continue serve. Both sides are ready for play. Ball sails long, official flag goes up immediately calling out. 22-21, Grace Prep, Sage Post with the serve. 22-21, serving with the lead is number 15, Sage Post, senior outside hitter for Grace Prep. We're setting on the near side to number nine. Number nine, that's Brooke Cox. Brooke Cox again with the point. Ties us at 22 all. Number four, Callie Johnston steps to the service line. Number four, Callie Johnston for Lubbock Trinity, all knotted up to 22 apiece. Arlington Grace Prep, Lubbock Trinity Christian. Good return, goes over the net, mishandled. Lubbock Trinity can't get it over, four hits. Gives the point to Grace Prep. Grace Prep Academy, 23. Trinity Christian School, 22. Looks like number two, that's going to be Madison McDonald stepping back to serve. Ball played in. Ball played high. That's number nine. Good block at the net by Grace Prep. Number three shoots it back over. That was Bonnie Davis. This is number 12 for Lubbock. Sends the ball off a Grace Prep player. That was Madeline Cox. Madeline Cox ties this back up at 23. And number nine, Brooke Cox will step back. Senior outside here, Brooke Cox up serve. See where we're headed. Good job of moving the ball to the middle. This time we're setting Madeline Ritchie. Madeline Ritchie into the block. Block scores the point for Grace Prep. Grace Prep up 24-23, serving for the second set. Ball goes to Hannah Reeves on the serve. We have a timeout on the court by Lubbock Trinity to re-rally the troops. Grace Prep 24, Lubbock Trinity 23 here in game set number two. Thank you for joining us on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio, live from Waco University High, TAPS Volleyball 2019. On the whistle, on the horn, Lubbock Trinity waiting to serve of number six, Hannah Reeves. Number six, Hannah Reeves serving for Grace Prep. Set point, 24-23, see what she can do. We're gonna stay on the near side to Richie. Richie tries to fight through the block, unable to. We come back to Richie, she hits again. Good recovery on the backside by Sage Post. This is number three, Bonnie Davis. She came cross court. We look to see if there's a touch. No touch is called. We're tied at 24. 24 apiece. Love of Trinity with the serve. Number 13, that's Lily Underwood returning to serve. Number 13, Lily Underwood. 
junior setter for Lubbock Trinity. We go far side to Davis. Davis comes off a quick block. This time we're setting number five, Madeline Ritchie. Ritchie off the block, back in her face. This time we go to Ritchie again. She tries to fight through the block of number one. That's number one, Courtney Creighton. She had help there from number 14, Lacey Young. Excellent at the net. 25-24, Grace Prep in the lead. Number three, Bonnie Davis with the serve. Love the trendy able to handle. We set on the near side to Marino. Unable to control the ball. Point. Love it, Trinity. We're all tied at 25 apiece. 25 and number three for Love it, Trinity. Peyton Dove steps back to serve. Peyton Dove, our senior player for Love it, Trinity, with the serve. All tied at 25. We go wide to Sage Post. Block at the net. This time we set Bonnie Davis from deep. Flag goes up immediately, calling the ball long. Lubbock Trinity with the lead and the chance for the set, up 26-25. And it's number three, Peyton Dove, seeing if she can close it out. Number three, Peyton Dove, up 25-26-25 uh, for Trinity. We're setting Sage Post. Sage Post with a little short dump. Set it back up again. Our setter, Kenzie Burleson, sends it over. Ball goes over on the net. That's Courtney Creighton. Courtney Creighton ties us up at 26. See who's stepping back to serve for Grace Prep. Grace Prep's going to send number 14, Lacey Young, freshman, with the serve. We're all tied up at 26 here in Waco, Texas, semifinal number two. Off of Burleson, we come this near side to Burleson. Courtney sets on the far side. She sets Sage Post. Ball goes up at the net. Lubbock Trinity keeps it in play. Bur Burleson sends it back over this way to Richie. This time Creighton sets Sage Post at the net. They're able to keep it in play. Lubbock Trinity with a hit, unable to find ground. Now we set number 15, Sage Post on the far side. She sends it to the net. So Lubbock Trinity, 27, Grace Prep, 26. And number five, Madeline Ritchie with the serve. Madeline Ritchie with the serve, up 27-26. Conference with the referee won by both teams. No change, just 27-26. Madeline Ritchie with the ball, see if she can close it out. They won set number one. Now they're trying to win set number two. Close this out and bring us to the third. Coach Lewis continues the conversation, but it's going to be Madeline Ritchie with the serve. Ball played off the net, reset. This time Burleson comes near side to number nine, Cox. Cox is able to sit down. We're setting on the far side to Sage Post. Sage Post with a really good hit, but it's recovered. Grace Prep resets again. This time it's a quick dump by Courtney Creighton. Burleson recovers. Sent back over. Grace Prep at the net. Creighton setting number three, Bonnie Davis. This time we're setting Marino at the block, at the point. See what the official signal. It looks to me like that's a point for Lubbock Trinity. And that is second set, second set taken 28-26 by the Lions of Lubbock Trinity Christian School. Trinity Christian School, two sets. Arlington Grace Prep zero as we move to set number three here on TAPS TV for 4A volleyball action live from Waco, Texas. Thank you for joining us on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio. Hi, we're thrilled to be here today with our new partner, Chipotle. Um, and I'm here with Shane, and Shane is representing them here in Texas. And we're thrilled with this new partnership. Tell us a little bit about why Chipotle chose to be a partner with TAPS. Yeah, so Chipotle understands the importance of nutrition. And so Chipotle has essentially started a whole new initiative of Real Food for Real Athletes. And Chipotle understands that 
um, athletes need to eat a little differently than the regular Joe. And so they are bringing proper nutrition and a little bit of education to the sports world. And then tell us a little bit about what you're doing with the schools. Um, once you've met with the coaches here in the hospitality lounge at volleyball, um, tell us what your goal is um, in interacting with our coaches and our families. Yeah, so we're working to get into the schools to provide athletes education on um, the proper ways to eat. So we will talk to coaches, um, first get them to understand that um, what we're doing is going to be beneficial for their program, for them, and for their athletes. And so we will then go in, uh, we'll talk to their athletes, we'll give nutrition talks, team talks, um, however that may be, um, and we'll talk to the athletes about macronutrients and the fuel that they put in their body. Now, I understand that you guys are actually giving out trophies as well. Are you a good luck charm? Are you influencing who wins? I don't know if I'm going to influence who wins, but I will sure be a great little token once they do win. Absolutely. And perhaps if they've had um, real food for real athletes, they will win. Thank you, Shane. Radio. Thank you for joining us. We're live from Waco University High. We want to thank Waco ISD for hosting this year's championships. And we especially want to send a shout of appreciating out for TASO, TASO, the Texas Association of Sports Officials, for taking care of our kids and for providing the officials for today's contest. Thank you, TASO. Thank you, officials, for all you do. We couldn't play the games without you. Approximately a minute and a half left in the intermission between the sets. Lubbock Trinity in red will be on your left. Grace Prep and Navy will be on your right. Lubbock Trinity comes out to await their opponents. Officials are getting ready. Coach Lewis with her final words here before coming out of the break. See if she can rally the troops. She's down two sets to none. Both sets have been close. A point here, a point there. Could have changed the outcome. On the horn, both teams are returned to action. Officials are checking the rosters, checking them twice as we go into the third set. So, teams are ready, coaches are ready, officials almost ready. On the whistle, we'll have Madeline Ritchie of Lubbock Trinity with the first serve of set number three. Good backside set to number three, Bonnie Davis. Bonnie Davis sends Grace Prep ahead, 1-0. And Bonnie Davis will serve. 
Second time in this match that the goals have come into play. Grace Prep 2, Trinity Christian School 0. Bonnie Davis. Junior outside hitter for Grace Prep. Good tip over that time at number four. Unable to clear. Grace Prep unable to get it back over the net. That was number four, Kelly Johnston, the setter. Number zero, Libero, Kinsey Burleson with serve. Good return, comes back this way. This time Johnson looks to set number nine, Cox. Good block by Grace Prep. Number 12, Cox sends the ball over. This time we're gonna set Sage Post for Grace Prep. Good block at the net, able to control. We go wide to number nine, Cox. Good dump that time. Courtney Creighton has great timing on that. She's done it several times today. Point Grace Prep, good job. Courtney Creighton, our junior setter for Grace Prep. Grace Prep three, Lubbock Trinity one. It's gonna be number 14 sending the ball into play. That's Lacey Young. Ball comes wide as they're unable to control for Trinity. Point Grace Prep. Grace Point Grace Prep stretches out this early lead to 4-1 here in set number three. Ball set high into the middle. That's number nine. That was Brooke Cox with the hit. Brooks Cox with the point. Brings Lubbock Trinity to two, Grace Prep to four. We have number four, Callie Johnston with the serve. Net serve results in point for Grace Prep. Grace Prep five, Lubbock Trinity two. It's going to be number one. This is our junior setter, Courtney Creighton, with the serve. Ball goes deep. They call it in. Flag went in immediately. Officials have been quick and decisive on their calls today. Point, Grace Prep. Grace Prep with the 5-3 lead. Number nine, I'm sorry, Lubbock Trinity with the serve. That was Brooke, Brooke Cox. Now we set Richie. Richie comes cross court. This time it's Bonnie Davis coming from the back end. It's going to bounce around the goal. Saved by number three off another goal. Again, the goals come into play. Third time in this match. But it results in a point for Grace Prep. Grace Prep six, Lubbock Trinity three at the service line. Number 15, Sage Post for Grace Prep. Barlison comes to Johnston. Johnston sets number three for her own team. Peyton Dove. Peyton Dove with the hit. Lubbock Trinity four. Grace Prep Academy six. Number 12 steps back to serve. Madeline Cox. Dump is garnered in by Lubbock Trinity and whistle point Grace Prep. Grace Prep seven, Lubbock Trinity Christian School four. It's our libero number two, Madison McDonald. Ball misplayed out of the corner but recovered. Kenzie Burleson sends it over. This time we go to number 14, Lacey Young for Grace Prep. We're setting on the far side to Madeline and Richie. That's a point for Grace Prep. Grace Prep eight, Lubbock Trinity Christian School four here in set number three. Lubbock Trinity won the first two. Grace Prep trying to get back in the match. Number two, Madison McDonald to serve. Ball sent wide to Richie. Good job of McDonald to recover the ball. We're sent close to number three, Bonnie Davis. 
Bonnie Davis with the hit on the whistle. Point, Grace Prep. Grace Prep, nine. Lubbock Trinity, four. Madison McDonald, number two. Ball goes short, played well. Johnson goes behind her to number three. She found Peyton Dove. Peyton Dove earns the point. Lubbock Trinity, five. Arlington Grace Prep, nine. Number three, that's going to be Peyton Dove. Earned the point. Now she's at the service line. Lubbock Trinity serving five, serving nine. Coach Neal's got his assignment in. See what Dove can do with the ball. Barely clipped the net. Makes it hard when it does that. And they earn the point for Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity pulls closer. Lubbock Trinity six. Arlington Grace Prep nine. Dove again with the serve. Dove the senior in control. Number 15, Sage Post had a hard time with that one. Earns another point for Lubbock Trinity. She's pulling it within two. Lubbock Trinity, seven. Arlington Grace Prep, nine. Excellent save by Burleson. They push the ball to Richie, number five. She plays the ball wide. Good job by Bonnie Davis. Courtney Creighton gets the ball back over. Johnston setting Richie. Richie comes off the block. Grace Prep, three opportunities. Could not corral it. Excellent job. Excellent job by both teams. But it's a point earned by Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity eight. Grace Prep nine. Peyton Dove continues with serve. Time we go far side. We were looking at number six, and we found her. Hannah Reeves with the point earned for Grace Prep. Number three, Bonnie Davis steps back to serve. Grace Prep leading 10-8 here in this third set. Sorry, they're talking to each other, and we now have number six, Hannah Reeves. <laughs> Officials and coach were conferring on the service order. It is number six, Hannah Reeves with the serve. Grace Prep leading 10-8. Kenzie Burleson sends the ball over the net and on the tip and on the block. Grace Prep point. Grace Prep 11-8 for Lubbock Trinity. Three-point lead number six. Hannah Reeves with the serve. The deeper Lubbock Trinity sets, the way they go. That was number 14, Marino. And number 14 for Grace Prep. That's Lacey Young with the point. Grace Prep 12, Lubbock Trinity 8. Again, number six, Reeves with service. Cox to Johnston to Ritchie. Good job by Grace Prep to keep it in the field to play. McDonald sends it back over. Burleson to Johnston to Marino. Marino with the tip. McDonald was there waiting. This time we set number three, Bonnie Davis, and Bonnie Davis is not having any of it. She sends the kill. Bonnie Davis brings the score. Grace Prep 13, Lubbock Trinity 8 as we go to a timeout by Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity trails 8 to 13, but leads in sets 2 0. Thank you for joining us on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio for today's semifinal action. Aiden loves playing baseball. He's in his element when he picks up a baseball bat. When Aiden tore his ACL last year, we were all devastated. We didn't think that a 13 year old could have a problem such as that. Children's Health Andrews Institute for Orthopedic and Sports Medicine not only repaired Aiden's ACL, but they gave him the knowledge and skills to prevent any future injuries. Now, less than a year later, he's back to hitting homers and doing phenomenal. This is the biggest deficit either team has faced at five. Grace Prep ahead, 13 to eight. Thank you for joining us on TAPS Radio and TAPS TV for today's contest from Waco ISD University High. 
want to remind you that Earth Networks has been taking the pulse of the planet for more than 20 years. Earth Networks helps schools mitigate financial, operational, and human risk by providing environmental intelligence from the world's largest hyperlocal weather network. We appreciate Earth Networks for being our TAPS partner and spot, helping to sponsor TAPS Volleyball 2019. Number six, Hannah Reeves will take the serve for Arlington Grace Prep. Ball sent wide to Richie. Richie sends the ball at McDonald. Point for Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity nine, Grace Prep 13. Number five, Richie will now go to serve. Serve Lubbock Trinity. Madeline Richie sends us over the net. Courtney Creighton, she sets number three, Bonnie Davis. Bonnie Davis tries to fight through the block. We reset on the far side to number nine, Brooke Cox. Ball played deep. Sage Post sends the ball back over. This time, we're going to set number nine, Brooke Cox. And this time, she fights through the block. Point Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity 10, Grace Prep 13. Every point's highly contested. Number five, Madeline Ritchie, junior outside hitter for Lubbock with the serve. Courtney Creighton, this time she comes to 15, post goes low. Johnston with the tip over, earns the point. Both setters have done an excellent job today of finding that tip opportunity. Point, Lubbock Trinity, Lubbock Trinity 11, Grace Prep 13, Ritchie with the serve. Ball sails long, flag up immediately. Officials confer, it is out. Grace Prep 14, Lubbock Trinity 11. It's gonna be number three, Bonnie Davis with the serve for Grace Prep. Almost found the top of the net, but it was a little low. Net serve, Lubbock Trinity 12, Grace Prep 14, number zero. That's going to be libero Kinsey Burleson. She'll be serving for Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity trails by two, 12 to 14 here in set number three. Creighton comes to Sage Post. Sage Post is returned to the front. She's looking to attack Bonnie Davis from the back line. They go wide. Burleson able to get it over. Lacey Young keeps it in play. Sage Post dumps over. Burleson to Johnston. Johnston dumps. Good job by Mason McDonald to keep it in play. Number 15, Sage Post shoots deep. Johnston sends the ball far side. Brooke Cox. This time the flag goes down. They say it's in. Officials concur and agree. Lubbock Trinity 13. Grace Prep 14. Kinsey Burleson with the serve. Kenzie Burleson, number zero, serving 13 to 14. Good job by Bonnie Davis. She goes to McDonald. McDonald goes to post. Post off the block. Johnson resets and goes wide across court to Cox. On the whistle. Grace Prep point. Grace Prep with the point. They're now ahead 15 to 13. And number 14, that's Lacey Young, freshman middle. Lacey Young with the serve for Grace Prep. Johnston goes wide. There's Brooke Cox again. Unable to corral it off the block. Point Grace Prep. Grace Prep moves ahead 16 to 13. It's a three point lead for Grace Prep with Lacey Young, freshman middle, number 14 with the serve. Coach Neal's trying to rally the troops. Burleson to Johnson. Johnson, number 12. Cox is unable to clear the block. This time we go to Brooke Cox. Ball saved and set wide. Cox to Johnston to Cox. This one is in. Point for Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity 14. Grace Prep 16. Both teams willing to take the big swing and the big hit. They've been in and out. Currently, Grace Prep leads 16 to 14 with number four. Callie Johnson, our setter at the serve. Ball played off of Grace Prep. That's point Lubbock. Lubbock Trinity 15. Arlington Grace Prep 16. Callie Johnston at the serve.
Ball played to the middle, into the middle. We go wide to Sage Post. Post puts the ball in play. Good job by Johnson. We're going to set number nine. That's Brooke Cox. That time the flag goes up. It's out and it's long. Grace Prep point. Grace Prep leads 17 to 15. 17 15 and number one, Courtney Creighton, junior setter for Grace Prep. Number nine, Brooke Cox with the hit. Grace Prep couldn't quite get their feet underneath them. Number 13, Taylor Morgan, and number one, Courtney Creighton colliding. Point Lubbock Trinity, Lubbock Trinity 16, Grace Prep 17. It's gonna be number nine, Brooke Cox with the serve. Good service received. We go wide to number 15, Sage Post, the block at the net. Earns the point for Lubbock Trinity, and we're all tied at 17-17 here in set number three. Lubbock Trinity leads two sets to zero. Number nine, Brooke Cox again with the serve. Able to get down, but not able to keep it in play. Point goes to Lubbock Trinity. Lubbock Trinity takes an 18-17 lead. Brooke Cox, service again. Ball kept in play. This time we're going to set number 15, Sage Post. She can't clear the block from here. It looked like number five and number 12. It looked like Madeline Ritchie and Madeline Cox both getting up. 19-17, to 17, Lubbock Trinity forces the timeout by Grace Prep. Grace Prep uses her timeout to stem the tide. 19, Lubbock Trinity, 17, Grace Prep, game three. We appreciate you joining us for the 4A semifinal live from Waco University High here on TAPS TV and TAPS Radio. Back at the action, NCSA, Next College Student Athletes Recruiting Network, connects over 2 million student athletes to more than 35,000 college coaches nationwide and across all sports. Learn more and find your best college fit by visiting ncsasports.org. And our representative, Frank Ditta. Number nine, Brooke Cox sends us back into play with Lubbock Trinity, leading 19 to 17 as Grace Prep and Navy returns to the court on the right. Lubbock Trinity in red. Cox is ready. Service, deep right corner. It caught the line. The flag goes down. It was at the official speed. All officials confer. It's 20 to 17, Lubbock Trinity. Brooke Cox continues with serve. This time with a three point lead, 20 to 17. Good job that time by Grace Prep to get low. This is number Three, number three, Peyton Dove went deep in the corner. Lubbock Trinity 21, Grace Prep 17. Courtney Creighton called her teammates together. She's warmed them back up. Cox sends the ball into play. Good service received. This time we come to the near side to number six. It's a tip by Hannah Reeves for a Grace Prep point. Hannah Reeves brings Grace Prep 18, Trinity 21, and number 15, that's Sage Post, senior outside hitter with the serve. Johnston, see who she said. She set number three. She found Peyton Dove behind her. We have an injury on the court. We'll have our trainers from Children's Health Andrews Institute enter the court here momentarily to see what the injury is.
here on site to attend. Looks like it's an ankle injury, and we'll see how long we stay down. Thank you for joining us on TAPS TV. Thank you for joining us on TAPS Radio for today's semifinal action. Hi, we're thrilled to be here today with our new partner, Chipotle. Um, and I'm here with Shane, and Shane is representing them here in Texas. And we're thrilled with this new partnership. Tell us a little bit about why Chipotle chose to be a partner with TAPS. Yeah, so Chipotle understands the importance of nutrition. And so Chipotle has essentially started a whole new initiative of Real Food for Real Athletes. And Chipotle understands that um, athletes need to eat a little differently than the regular Joe and so they are bringing proper nutrition and a little bit of education to the sports world. And then tell us a little bit about what you're doing with the schools um, once you've met with the coaches here in the hospitality lounge at volleyball. Um, tell us what your goal is um, in interacting with our coaches and our families. Yeah, so we're working to get into the schools to provide athletes education on um, the proper ways to eat. So we will talk to coaches, um, first get them to understand that um, what we're doing is going to be beneficial for their program, for them, and for their athletes. And so we will then go in, uh, we'll talk to their athletes, we'll give nutrition talks, team talks, um, however that may be, um, and we'll talk to the athletes about macronutrients and the fuel that they put in their body. Now, I understand that you guys are actually giving out trophies as well. Are you a good luck charm? Are you influencing who wins? I don't know if I'm going to influence who wins, but I will sure be a great... Abigail Knessick enters the contest for Grace Prep. We're back to play. Bonnie Davis exits the field. Knessick enters the play. Coaches and officials moving players where they need to be. Lubbock Trinity looks to their coach, Coach Neal, having a discussion with the, the book. R2 on the far side of the court, unable to really tell what the discussion is. Number seven is substituted for number three. Should still be the serve of number nine, Brooke Cox, senior outside hitter for Lubbock Trinity. Officials say the court's ready for play. Officials return to the corners. Lubbock Trinity in red on your left. Grace Prep and Navy on your right. It's going to be number 12, Madeline Cox. Number 12, Madeline Cox leading 22 to 18. Lubbock Trinity. 12 is going to sub out. 13, that's Lily Underwood returns to serve. Number 13, Lily Underwood returning to serve. Trying to get our rotation in order for Grace Prep. I think Grace Prep had it right the first time, but the officials are having a long discussion as to who goes where. It's always tough when your teammate goes down injured. They'll have to rally here. Kanasik, she's in the game. She's ready to play. Sophomore outside hitter seeing her first action today. Number 13, Lily Underwood with the serve. They come right at Kanasik. Excellent job of serve receive. On the far side, that was Sage Post with the hit. Apologize, I'm going to give credit over on the far side to Hannah Reeves. Ball sailed out of bounds, but she was swinging for the fences on that one. 23 to 18, Trinity with the lead. Number 13, Lily Underwood. Good job by Kanasik. They're going to keep serving her. That's number six on the far side. Sends it off a Trinity player. Credit to Hannah Reeves. Hannah Reeves earns the point for Grace Prep. Grace Prep 19, Trinity Christian 23. Service goes to number two. That's Macy McDonald. I'm sorry, Madison McDonald. Sorry, Madison. I've got it right all the time up until that point. Number two, Madison McDonald. I'm not mistaken, and I'm not. It's a left-handed serve. Goes to the far side. A little harder to handle. We're going to set Richie. Richie, and it's in. Richie's shot went to the baseline, and it was in. 24, Lubbock Trinity Christian School. 19, Arlington Grace Prep Academy. Number three, that's Peyton Dove. Peyton Dove to serve.
we're going to have a timeout by Grace Prep. Coach Lewis trying to rally her troops. It's set and match point 24 to 19. Love a Trinity when we return here on TAPS TV. And T Aiden loves playing baseball. He's in his element when he picks up a baseball bat. When Aiden tore his ACL last year, we were all devastated. We didn't think that a 13 year old could have a problem such as that. Children's Health Andrews Institute for Orthopedic and Sports Medicine not only repaired Aiden's ACL, but they gave him the knowledge and skills to prevent any future injuries. Now, less than a year later, he's back to hitting homers and doing phenomenal. Thank you for joining us here today for the second semifinal to see who will face Bernie Geneva School of Bernie. The Eagles earned a four set victory to move on to tomorrow's championship tomorrow at 10 a.m. Which school will face them? We have number three Peyton Dove serving for match serving for the set 24 to 19 our score. Number 15 Sage Post. They go wide. That was number six on the far side. Hannah Reeves earning the Grace Prep point. Grace Prep's not through. Grace Prep 20, Trinity Christian School 24. Serve will be coming from Hannah Reeves. Hannah made that excellent shot. Here we go. Hannah Reeves. Burleson, Johnston, Ritchie. Ball goes out and off. It's a Lubbock Trinity victory. Lubbock Trinity wins the third game, 25 to 20. 25 20 and a 3 0 sweep. Thank you for joining us here on Taps Radio and Taps TV. Stay tuned as shortly we will have the all uh, recognition of the Final Four team. Final Four recognition for Grace Prep on a great season. It ended here today, but they fought valiantly. Thank you for joining us on Taps Radio and Taps TV. Great sportsmanship by both teams there. Appreciate Lubbock Trinity coming over. We will have the final four awards presentation here momentarily. Kevin Lewis, Chipotle, real food for real athletes. Out to assist Robert Huckabee from the TAPS office. Coach Prentice Lewis will now award the medals to her team. We appreciate her hard work and all the work of her team. Bonnie Davis is up on crutches, but she fought valiantly through the whole set. Congratulations to Grace Prep on an excellent season and earning their Final Four opportunity. Now for the team to receive their Final Four awards. Again, thank you for Chipotle, our new partner. Chipotle, real food for real athletes. This time we'll recognize the players. Number one, Courtney Creighton, junior setter. Number two, Number two, libero, sophomore, Madison McDonald. Number three, Bonnie Number three outside hitter, junior, Bonnie Davis. Number four, defensive specialist, that's sophomore Rebecca Turner. Number six, Anna Reeves, junior setter. Number seven, 
Number six, right middle blocker, Hannah Reeves, Jr. Number seven, Abigail Kanasik, a sophomore outside hitter. Number 10, Natalie Rogers Dunlap, a sophomore middle blocker. Number 12, Lydia Carreri, a sophomore defensive specialist. Number 13, that's Taylor Morgan, senior middle blocker. Number 14, Lacey Young, freshman middle blocker. And rounding out the squad, number 15, Sage Post, senior outside hitter. Congratulations to Coach Lewis on an excellent season. And we want to congratulate the Lubbock Trinity Christian School Lions as Coach Neal will take his squad against the Geneva School of Bernie tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. We look forward to you joining us for that broadcast and for that game. Tomorrow's championship from Waco University High, Taps Volleyball 4A Championship, Taps Volleyball 2019 on Taps Radio and Taps TV.